Hello dear spectators, you are watching Creep Story Channel and it's really nice to see you again here. To remind you are watching Creep Story Channel and it's time for a fresh ICO review. So as usual let's start from a very beginning. Today we have a very interesting topic called Cube Chain and it's all about blockchain. Actually it's a new generation of blockchain system. So, let's try to find out together what is it and how we can use it. First of all, let's start from the very beginning. I need to say that Cube Chain is a new generation of blockchain. So, now I'll try to explain you how it will work. Against the traditional blockchain system, uh, one cube, I mean uh, one cube in the cube, cube chain system, uh, created by 27 blocks 24 blocks are just uh, almost the same like in blockchain system but uh, they have got other three special blocks and uh, let's watch a small introductory video to fully understand um, these features I mean the features of these blocks so let's watch it Oh guys, but uh, before doing it, I need to say some interesting information about the blocks. So um, when the data block is created, uh, the cubin proceeds and the generated cube creates another hash value. All written uh, blocks will continue to create a cube and the hash will connect cube to cube. This is the first verification that occurs when the blocks are connected. Uh, the second verifi verification that occurs when the cube is connected and it has much stronger encryption technology than the existing blockchain. So what we have uh, in the end? Transaction speed will increase, mm, data capacity will enhance and it's all clear why. Data storage is bigger because the size of blocks is bigger too. It is more secure and safe and of course it's more transparent. They even implement here, I mean in the service, a medical information exchange platform, integrated login system and prediction system. The last one is for cal calculating the statistics for uh, non-categorical continuous data. It's really cool as for me, but <laughs> I a little digress. Let's finally watch the introductory video. Actually, the full screen video isn't going well on the website, maybe because of my internet connection, but actually everything is working well. So let's watch it on YouTube. The cube chain is not a technology that merely connects a block to another, but it is the brand new core technology that creates 27 blocks and combines them into a cube. In total, a cube consists of 27 blocks. While 24 of them record the ledger, the other three special blocks take on their own special functions. Each of the three blocks has its own special function, like indexing, which organizes the whole data concisely, static, which expedites the system by gathering commonly used data, and escrow, which provides conditional certification that only functions upon both parties' approval. The first encryption initiates when combining 27 blocks into a queue. When the blocks are combined and the cube becomes a block, the second encryption follows. During this process, the three special blocks cross-check the data and lead to the third encryption, which makes the system even safer. The cube chain could handle greater volume of transactions compared to others. And this is that. This is how it should work in the 21st century. While the other guys, uh, I mean the developers of ICOs using blockchain for creating new ICOs, the guys from cube chain just created their own blockchain system. Uh, and it's really cool because the blockchain system is not is not the top of our civilization or or, or it's, it is not the top of our technologies. So that is why 
cool guys from cube chain started working at the project so and now what we uh, what we have a cube chain a really new generation blockchain and so uh, let's go on here you can find uh, the working process uh, i mean the ecology ecosystem of uh, cube chain so a lot of uh, participants and a lot of uh, services and features implemented in this service and all the combination of them uh, can guarantee a fully working and stable process and this is that finally let's talk about the tokens uh, this information is usual you can find on the front page or in the white paper so the primary token is cube chain and the symbol is cube Pay attention guys that uh, they're different not cube chain so q u b not c u b so uh, different names of uh, of the tokens so uh, the total amount of tokens is 20 billion of uh, cube tokens for the next 50 years uh, one cube token one Ethereum approximately costs for about 8,000 cube tokens. So what else? Mm, any other interesting information as usual you can find in the white paper or on the website or on the social networks as always. Guys remember that our video is not an advice for your investments. It is just our view about this platform. If this video was helpful for you, please keep in touch <laughs> and subscribe on our videos and give us a thumbs up. Thank you for watching us. See you soon.